So thank you, first of all, making till here. Uh, it has been a rough day, rough 24 hours. My colleague could not be here because he missed his flight. And uh, one of the colleagues could not be here because their flight was canceled. So yeah, thank you. Thank you, everyone, for coming. A big round of applause for all of you. Thank you. I will be presenting about Prism X today. Uh, it's an omnichannel programmatic engagement platform for our marketeers. It's a 360 degree connected platform powered by mobile revenue. <clears throat> mob revenue has been into this ecosystem for our publishers, for our ad tech partners, for our advertisers, marketeers from 2017. I think in previous session, someone asked what, which films describes best about your company. I would say Swadesh and Ham Saath Saath. Because we are growing with our partners, with our clients, and we are made in India, and we are glo going global. <coughs> we have delivered 25,000 campaigns till date, served 150 customers, 2 billion consumers reached worldwide, we have our own in-house DSP. So it caters from performance to branding everywhere. As I said, made in India, going global, seven plus offices worldwide, 150 plus teams, and we have eight upcoming offices in 2026. Today, we launch connected ecosystem, which is Prism X. Why connected ecosystem is important? You have to ask, if you are choosing a partner, you have to ask them right questions to get the right audience at a right place. It can be on a CTV, it can be on a mobile device, or it can be in screen near your home, which is a DOH. Prism X, a 360 degree connected ecosystem, transparent, clean, and easy to use. With us, you can reach, amplify, grow, and showcase your ads across all channels through the power of connected TV and video. From open web till DOH, we cover everything. And we make a sync among everything. Now, let's connect by addressing some key challenges. So we, we did ask our clients, uh, advertisers and publishers both, uh, and our agency partners, that what are the certain challenges you face. So before I show you the results, I would also put same questions here too, and let's see. The results did surprise us. Now let's see, did, does it surprise you too? Do you know about connected ecosystem and CTV? Uh, people have heard about it. No, raise of hands. Raise of hands, raise of hands. Okay, okay. Do you know both are different? Let's see what what we have the results. Yes, pro with it, we are running campaigns. We also heard that, no, we have just seen on LinkedIn. Uh, and very few people uh, said that, no, we don't know about it. But 53% says yes, 40% says saw only on LinkedIn as a content. They have never tried it. Do you run YouTube campaigns? Yes but also facing problems with it because of wall gardens. What we are saying is open internet is where you will see maximum of reach, scale, and no restrictions with your campaigns or with your audience targeting or even getting your audience back from the ecosystem. Now, only 37% are running CTV campaigns outside the wall gardens. What we are doing is presenting here the platform to reach to your audiences across all channels and make it connected with very easy to use DSP and a transparent ecosystem. We'll see how we do it. Okay, the question for the forum, do you think CTV and addressable TV are different or same? Uh, for same, just, just give me a raise of hands if you think it's same. For different, anyone? Perfect, less of hands, perfect. Yes, it is different. Reason being, your addressable TVs, you can also tap in the linear uh, TV channels. But with CTV, you can go only on the, the CTV ecosystem, you can tap 
all the content providers which are coming through internet. Addressable TV is, you, you can count, like, let's say, linear channels and connected TV. It can tap in both. In India, it is still picking it up, but CTV has grown exponentially. We are almost talking about 45 million households at least this year, and by 2026, we are targeting almost 75 million households. That means these are households, co-viewing impressions. It's not a single person watching a TV. Maybe a couple of decision makers are watching it together. But how do we tap into that? We'll see. Does ad front happen on CTV? Anyone raise of hands? Has anyone experienced the fraud, ad frauds happening on connected ecosystem? Do you think it, it happens? Yes, no. For yes, give me a hand. Yes. For no, do you think it's not possible? It does happen. So we have to make sure when you choose partner, it is fully transparent. It gives you all the right things at the right place. We asked our clients, what are our pain points? We are good listeners. We did ask them and we worked on those points and we are presenting all of that into our current DSP. So if anyone has run any CTV campaigns here, what is your biggest challenge? Can anyone say anything? Scale, reach, anything else? These were a couple of things which came out of that survey and maximum of that we, we just combined and made sure that top ones are shown here. What we are here for to solve these issues, how do we solve it? See, connected ecosystem is considered as top of the funnel. We want to make sure that as a branding, we are present everywhere from the screens you own to the screens near you through CTV and housing. Let's say, I think in previous session, it was explained that how do you reach out to people who are watching TV, but you want to interact with them. We catch the IP, we catch the hotspot, and show the ads to your nearest devices. Now that can be device owned by you or device near you through a pin code targeting where you either you are in your corporate parks or residence park, wherever you are, we, we can tap that. So from CTV housing, video and DOH, we cover everything in our top funnel. And because mob avenue caters to all the three funnels, that's why we become a 360 degree connected ecosystem. But why? Now the biggest challenges with any, with, with the current connected ecosystem is fragmented supply. You have different creative aspects coming from different channels. Uh, there are complexities to run the campaign and obviously the ad fraud and the way now, so nowadays everyone has four to five OTTs in your apps, right? It's difficult to cater to a unique reach. You may see an ad on one OTT four times and similar ad on a different OTT in the same day, again, four to five times. So reach and frequency have been the concerns. So this, the ad wastage and the limited control as an advertiser it is a problem for them. So we solve that. How do we solve that? We solve it by showing across multiple channels, multiple formats with 30 plus ad formats available with us, including pre-testing. Now what is pre-testing? Pre-testing helps you to identify which of my creatives would do better with my campaign. Say for example, if you, we, we suggest you with the help of our algorithms, we suggest you which ad you should run whether you should lower its aspect, whether you should introduce certain character in that, we do that across all formats. So from your small screens to the larger screens, from your mobile apps to your DOH, including CTV of all sizes. For whom? For our brands and agencies. We want to be the one-stop shop under one roof. You get everything. So manage supply, self-serve, we help you optimize your campaigns. We help you to select uh, the supply you want and we help you to scale it because unique reach has been the concern for our advertisers. Self-serve is coming in, in, in two or three months. You will have a self-serve too 
right now you have managed with the dashboard option. This is what we are talking about. So you see an ad on CTV, we take that IP address, we make sure that all the, all the devices inside that are tapped and we show ads on it. Now, you may ask that, does a attribution happen on CTV? Indirectly, yes. Because if we are running a campaign and if there is an uptick on that IP address or on that vicinity, on that particular window, we can say that conversion is counted. This is the way the West is also doing. This is the way people have started doing performance on connected ecosystem. And our advertisers are loving it. How do we do it through our DSP? Our DSP is completely built from scratch in India, for India, and delivering outside also with the global standards, having all the USPs shown here. So you, you get a consultative expertise from both ad tech and martech side, because we have those expertise in-house. You get account managers as your extended team. You get creative help. You get supply. We cater supply for you. you whether those are four or five big OTTs, to the long tail OTTs, there are more than 40 plus OTTs right now available in India. Plus, you get a granular and real time reporting with us. You don't have to pick a call or call anyone to get, hey, send me reports, do this thing for me. No, everything is on your keyboard. What will be the next steps from here? We help you identify your supply. We help you to create audience. Now, the good part about this is you can also upload your audience if you have, uh, in terms of, let's say, you have cookie ID, you have device IDs, you can upload your first party data, you can enrich your data, you can run campaigns on that. And you can also use our third party partnerships to enrich your data with the third party data providers. All that is available for all the platforms, not restricting to any particular platform. Once that is done, we assign a budget to you. Those budgets should not be heavy. It's not required that you should spend 50 lakh, 60 lakh, no. The budget amounts will be very, very less. Once the test is run, once you are happy, then we discuss about the next steps from here, what kind of uh, next integrations you want, and we run help you that campaign with all the detailed analysis for your uh, for your client. Now, those reports can also be given to you via APIs. That's all from my end. Uh, thank you. Now, if you want or any of your clients want to know about connected ecosystem or CTV or want to educate your clients, we will be doing a free 30 to 45 minute session, whether with you online in your office or in our office. We have a booth outside. You can scan the QR code or you can talk to our team out there and get a demo for you. That's, that's all. Thank you.